Cranky and I'm going to teach you how to drive a manual car. So in a manual car you have three pedals, the clutch, the brake and the accelerator. Inside the car, to your left of the driver's seat, you have a gear stick with first, second, third, fourth, fifth and reverse gears and a handbrake. So starting the car, first things first you want to put your seatbelt on. Then you want to get your key and put it here in the ignition. Put your left foot in the clutch fully, your right foot on the accelerator, and as you turn the engine on, you want to accelerate slightly so the engine starts. So right now I'm in neutral, which means it's in no gear. And to start, you want to put it into first. Then to get the car moving, you want to get the handbrake, Put the button in, push down, slowly ease your foot out of the clutch and accelerate at the same time until you start to move. So changing to second gear. Once you're driving, you'll hear the engine start to over rev. You want to put your foot in the clutch while still moving. Stop accelerating and change into second. Then take your foot out of the clutch and keep accelerating. Okay, so now that we're at a um, steady pace, you want to be moving up to fifth gear. We're currently in third and being over. <laughs> okay, so you want to put your clutch in, take your foot off the accelerator before you do that. Go into neutral, find four ease the clutch out and accelerate. Make sure you speed. Then, to find fifth, you want to do the exact same. Clutch in, neutral, fifth, clutch out and accelerate. Now that you're in fifth, there's no more gear changing to do until you want to start slowing down. So you just keep going and enjoy the ride. So one maneuver you have to do while driving a manual is a hill start. If you've stopped on a hill, you'll have your handbrake on and you want to go into first gear to start. Start accelerating, take your foot off the clutch and while you start, you feel the bite, you want to bring the handbrake off just as the clutch engages and you should go forward rather than rolling back, hopefully. Another thing you want to be able to do when you're driving a manual is stop. So when you're moving and you can see a part coming up, you want to put your foot in the clutch, ease on the brake until you stop at a nice speed. Pull the handbrake on if you're planning on parking and take out the ignition. Then you can take your foot off the clutch. If you take your foot off the clutch before you pull the key out, you'll stall. Hi, my name's Lexi and today Frankie's going to teach me how to drive a manual. Okay, Lexi, you ready to drive a manual? I am, Frankie. Okay, first things first, you want to put your seatbelt on. Well done. Now you want to put your right foot in the clutch. Make sure your car is in gear. What gear would I put that in? First gear? or reverse, depends where you're going, but we're going forward. Well done. Okay, now put the key in ignition and when you turn it to start, you want to accelerate at the same time, not too hard though. Okay, well done, not too hard. Okay, now are you ready to go forward? I am. Okay, so slowly take the handbrake off and really slowly as you ease your foot off the clutch, accelerate. Woo, well done! <laughs> okay, now to change your second, yes. you want to put your foot 
back in the clutch, your left foot. Perfect. Okay, you ready Thanks, to stop? Ready. I am. Put your foot in the clutch and brake. <laughs> well done. <laughs> now put the um, gear in neutral, which means no gear. Yep. Pull the handbrake on. Turn the key off with the clutch still in. Well done, Lexi. You can now drive a manual car. Thanks for the instructions, Frankie. It's okay. <laughs>